Hola mis amigos, tengo un mensaje antes de que empiece este video que si tú quieres ver este video de cómo transformamos estos patines um, ve al canal de Indie Jamma Jones en Planet Roller Ski y ahí va a estar la versión en español y también voy a poner un link abajo y acá arriba también Ok, bye Put a finger down when it's 2 a.m. and you live with roommates and you're in the kitchen so you have to film all your videos at night so no one bothers you because you get nervous when you're filming because even though you've been filming for a year now, you still cringe yourself out. It's me. Okay, hi everyone. I'm Karen the Carrot. Welcome to my... Oh, here you look. Welcome to my channel. If you guys know who does that, race the star. <laughs> Anyways, hi guys, welcome back to my channel. As you can tell, I'm in my kitchen today. It's two in the morning. I live with like six other roommates and sometimes filming is cringe for me when there's a lot of people. So I'm just like naturally a night person and now I got a ring light. So I'm sorry if it's distracting on my glasses, but I really can't see, it's dark and I panic, so <laughs> I have to wear them. Let me know if you're blind too, I would love to know them. <gasps> I guess you could say I'm almost as blind as that bat that destroyed the whole world because someone decided to eat it. Allegedly, I don't know, there's a lot of conspiracies behind it. Today I am going to do another little like a DIY upgrade thing. It's actually for a very special person and that is my little sister Melanie. I don't know if you guys follow my sister or not but I have a couple of videos with her. Um, she has purple hair. She has, she's been skating for like almost a year and a half I would want to say. She actually just finished her 365 day challenge so I'm so proud of her for that. So we're gonna do a little skate upgrade on her and she has her current setup is this right here. She has the yellow Moxie Lolly. She's had this skate up for about like a whole year now and she wants to dye it purple because suddenly she became a purple person and everything she wants to wear is purple. And this is also going to be an experiment because we are going to be using oil paints. I know that they make leather paint um, or like paint for suede but we don't have that, we have oil paints. And Scarlett, my best friend slash roommate slash skate buddy, she actually did a whole Candy Girl skate makeover with oil paints. And it came out really good. You guys should totally check out her channel. Um, check out that video. And they came out super cute, so now we wanna try it with the purple ones, or we wanna try it with her yellow ones, making them purple and like making this whole like, she wants to make it all like, purple like a grape so we want to do this whole skate makeover with those oil paints again and i just wanted to film it this time because i thought you guys should see how it like turns out because youtube life <laughs> so if you want to see the spanish version make sure to go to indy's channel and give it some love okay so this is gonna be a group project with my sister we're gonna dye them together and film but Right now, I'm gonna actually surprise her because I'm gonna wash and clean her skates so tomorrow when she wakes up, they'll be ready to go and she'll have to skip that process because, you know, I'm a nice sister or whatever. Right, let's get started. I'm just gonna brush them with a brush and some dish soap and water and a little tiny bit of bleach to see if I can get a little bit of that color out so it'll be a better canvas to paint on. Okay, let's get started on cleaning these bad boys. So here's a before. And then I'll do an after. So I'm just gonna start off by taking the laces off. All right, here's my little solution. And let's go. I'm gonna lay it flat like this. Oh my gosh, she already ripped it. Look. This is why you get toe guards. A 
other side. Okay, just look at this though. Dirty side? Side I just cleaned. Dirty side? Side I just cleaned. Can't wait for these to dry. This is it. So I have the skates ready. What I'm gonna do right now is just take off the wheels so I can paint them and I have more balance. So I did end up surprising my sister with the clean skates because she thought that we were gonna clean them together, but I was all like, hey, I just cleaned them for you so we can go ahead and get painting. I'm gonna put tape around the parts that I don't wanna get any paint on. And then my sister will join me in helping me paint them because that's what she really wanted to do. She doesn't wanna do all the tough work. Okay, so now we're ready to start the painting process. We got our stuff, we got our paint, we got our yes. skin. And this is my sister, Melly. For those who guys from Melly. I don't know her. She's my sister. Yes. I feel like a lot of people always ask us, like, or they're shocked when they find out that you're my sister. Yeah, they're either like surprised or shocked. Mm -hmm. Yes, we know. came out of the same womb. She is a Gemini. She's literally my sister sign. Hey. Okay, what color are we making these, Melly? What do you think? <laughs> <laughs> what do you think? I'll give you a hint. Hmm. It's the same color as her greasy mop on her head. <laughs> okay, so like I mentioned before, we're gonna be using some oil paints to paint the suede here. Um, I know that you can buy like suede dye and stuff like that, but since we're all quarantined, stuck in my house, our houses, we're gonna use what we've got, and I know that this works. It just takes a little bit longer to dry. So yeah. All right, so we're gonna use these brushes that are actually meant for oil painting. Um, and the reason that I have all of this is because I took an oil painting class when I was in college, and I had never really used anything but acrylic paint to paint and do art. So it was a really cool experience to learn how to use this type of material. I now have some and now we're gonna go dive right in. Alright, let's go. And how do you do this? <laughs> it's dark. Just like oh no. Bro, that looks black. No. There's no going back. <laughs> <laughs> no. What if we paint them first with white? Yeah. This toner, it's um, to clean your brushes. I'm just going to wet this a little bit. It smells weird. I'm hoping that this will make it like blend easier. Okay, so we're gonna paint on white first and then add the purple because this is too dark. That's caca. Do you see? <laughs> so should I fix this side first? Yeah. This is what it should look like. Okay, so I did a thin white layer all over the skate, not in the tongue, um, and then I'm gonna go in with the purple, but Melly already started doing the purple. <laughs> she didn't do both sides white. Yeah. But it looks cute. Do you it's like it? Gemini ass. This is Laker full. That's Laker full for Kobe. For Kobe. I'll put his name right here, <laughs> somewhere. Wait, do you like it so far though? Yeah, I noticed like the more you add the paint, the brighter it shows up. So this is like one layer and a half. So I don't know how many layers it's gonna take for like my desired color. But, yeah. 
I think you should keep the tongue dark purple. Ooh. Ah! Okay, purple time. Purple, purple, purple. Tiempo para poner morado. So, let's go! Sorry, Miley, I'm gonna block you for a little bit. But here's my skate that I did. Um, I kind of did like two layers of the purple, but it's so pretty. Um, I did the tongue as well, not the inside, but look at my hand. Oh my God. Because mm. you have to like be holding the skate on one hand and then paint it with the other one. And then for this little back part, I just added more purple so it looks a little bit darker and I think this is like really cute. And yeah, now we're just gonna wait. Um, the downside to painting with oil paints is that they do take a lot longer to dry completely. So we're just gonna let it stand. It sucks that it's been raining because if we could just put these out in the sun, it would make the dry time faster. And also I forgot to tape the plate. <laughs> So it's like all full of paint. But I'm sure Millie's gonna wanna paint them like some other color too. You're right. So she's almost done with hers. And then we're gonna put them out to dry. Okay, so I do wanna note that another ingredient that we're using with uh, the oil paint is this. It's called turpenoid. Turpenoid. And this is basically um, like a thinner, like a paint thinner, and you clean your brushes with this. Um, so what we're doing is we painted this on the suede first, just so the oil paint could have something kind of to like blend into and not just the dry suede, so this helps. And then if you're gonna be using oil paint, you need this to clean your brushes. And you usually put them in like little jars like this, um, this one is like, it barely has any, it looks dirty, but it's fine. Um, and then it has like a little spring in the middle so you can clean your brush. But yeah, you're gonna want it. You're gonna want this if you're gonna try this. Now is the most satisfying part of this whole makeover. And that is removing the tape. Look at how clean that is. Oh my God. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, and now I'm just putting on these really cute lavender moxie fun day wheels. My sister bought these herself. I still haven't tried these out. If you guys would like for me to try these out, make sure to leave me a comment because they're so cute. I really want to do try them out, but I don't know if y'all are interested or not. Whee! Okay, and she also got these really cute lavender laces to go with her purple skate setup. Can get these at planetwellerski.shop. I usually like to start with putting the beginning two and then straighten them out so they're equal. And then I like to do one all the way up first and then the other one. And I feel like I don't get as lost when I do it this way. And here are the finished products. Look at them, they're so bright. I really like how they turned out. I'm glad we did that white base coat because now they're like really bright and stuff. Um, we added these lavender fun day wheels, new bearings, and these periwinkle laces. Um, purple on purple on purple on purple. And you can get all of these accessories on planetrollerskate.shop, so make sure you check them out.
that's it for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this skate makeover with my little sister. I know I did. I had a lot of fun. I think the skates turned out really cute. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel because I'm going to do a second part decorate, helping to decorate my sister's skates. She just wants to add like a little bit of details, you know, a little bit of deep, deep, deep maybe some pixie dust i don't know she just wants to make a more extravagant so make sure you subscribe and be on the lookout for that part and if you guys need any roller skates or roller skate accessories make sure to go to planetrollerskate.shop for all your skate needs from helmet to toe stop and yeah again make sure to check out indy's channel for my version in spanish for all my spanish-speaking people yeah i'll see you guys next time bye